What up, what up, Mr. Hip Hop Vegan? Coming with another video, and today what I want to talk about is Beyond Meat. Well, hey, the whole rave of Beyond Meat. Now, I'm not gonna lie to you, it tastes good. The patties taste good, the sausages taste good, and the product is a, is a taste good product. However, now, okay, before I go to the however, if you're gonna transition, if you transitioning from eating meat and then transitioning to becoming plant-based or whatever and and um you transitioning and and you want to still have the meat taste but you want to eat it plant-based then it's okay but later down the road you're going to want to change to just straight plant-based straight food that you make yourself because as at the end of the day that food is still made in a lab it's still made in a big factory and stuff like that yeah we can talk about different um vegetables uh you know they gmo genetically modified and this and that blah 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 but if you're gonna eat the real thing eat the real thing make your own patties from scratch you can do that instead of buying it from the store if you look at the back of the um the beyond burgers you can see how much it, it has a lot of fat in it both burgers have a lot of fat. It usually come two in a package, I believe. They also have the bigger packages where it comes like 12 or 15. And they're pretty good. They're smaller. They're pretty good. So if you go into like a, a cookout or something like that and you want to bring those and share them, it's cool. But if I was you, just do not eat so much of it. I mean, it's still, like I said, it's still made in factories and stuff like that. And if you read the back, it's just too much fat. Too much fat for us to eat. And at the end of the day, that's not the whole point of becoming plant-based. You want to be healthier. You want to have less fat in your, in your food. The fat you eat is the fat you wear. And that's for everybody. All the top athletes, athletes that you see, they have to eat carbo, carbohydrates. Carbs, 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 carbohydrates. That's where, that's where the uh, power is at. Any of them top athlete, athletes, they need that carbs to, to push them and, and keep pushing them and, and keep going and stuff like that. And um, at the end of the day, just stay away. If you can, just stay away from from packaged foods and stuff like that. Me, I'm not even gonna lie. I probably eat it. I buy a pie once a month, once every two or three months, if that. Um, just to try some different techniques and stuff like that. I'm not really a good cook. My my goal for 2022 is to learn how to become more raw food based and also how to. I know it's oxymoronic, but how to uh, cook better uh, plant-based uh, food and stuff like that. So I, I'm following some Instagram channels that, that cook and stuff like that. So I'm just going to buy more ingredients and learn how to cook at home and, and cook for my mom and stuff like that to see what she thinks. Because I just go to her house when she wants to cook the rice and beans and stuff like that. But at the end of the day, stay away from the packaged foods. You don't need it. Too much fat. Too much grease and stuff like that. When you can tell when you cook it, you see how much how much fat comes out of it, how much grease and stuff like that. So don't think it's healthy because it's not healthy. It's the same thing eating vegan junk food. That's what I call it. You give uh, vegan junk food, the cookies. Um, that's what I'm coming down at. My 2022 goals is to, like I said, more raw food, more more carbs, more high, more high fruit more fruits in my in, in my diet and more fruits and vegetables and stuff like that not too much breads not too much rice and stuff like that just more wholesome plant-based foods so that's my my video watch out for them packaged food like my video share my video um subscribe to my channel please subscribe to my channel do that um don't eat it <laughs> peace <laughs>